between the anxiety and anticipation backstage before the show, the excitement on the runway during the show, and the huge sigh of relief when it's all over, it can be tough for a designer to gauge how successful his or her collection was in the eyes of the select crowd in attendance. And after that, how it will be picked up by the people out in the real world to whom the clothes are sold. So, at the latest New York shows, we decided to ask just how a designer knows when a show's been successful. How do you know when you've really done a great show? I mean, do you feel it in your heart before the girls even go out there? Is it, you know, when you take the final bow? No, uh, I never let my decision on the collection be based on its appearance out there. It's only, do, am I pleased with this? Now, when you look at the show, that's another deal. Is the show successful? Yeah, I mean, the girls didn't that's fall. The show. That's a different thing. With the clothes, I know well in advance. You feel it. What do you feel? <laughs> you feel it. You feel it. You feel the. Yeah, you have the feedback from the public, and you feel if you did a good job or not. When do you know that you've had a successful collection, and does it does it take until the buyers come into the showroom no, and I start getting get you the orders? from the show and, and from the press. I really do. And even maybe walking out on the runway at the end, can you yeah, sort of you catch can, that I think vibe? You, you can catch that vibe. I'm very happy about this collection. I hope everybody else is okay. <laughs> My single thought on that runway, while I'm walking off, I swear to you, this is the thought that occurs to me every single time. What am I doing next season? I don't even walk off thinking about the reviews. I'm like, okay, did this, done that, let's go there. And that's what I'm thinking about. I am, I'm not thinking about, oh, did they like it, did they not like it? Because if you invite somebody to have dinner in your house, is he going to tell you the food was terrible? No, they all come and say, oh, what a wonderful shop. But how do you know? You have it inside you, and you think it's good or bad. How do you know when a collection is, yeah, I've done it, it's great. Do you have to wait for the reviews? Do you have to wait for the orders to come in? No. How do you know? You know. 